Coach, uh, Odell said that uh, you came to him last Sunday and told him that you this was going to be a big week for you. We are going to step up for him. What was that conversation like? You can imagine it's just tense time. Everybody got to come together and make us come closer. He just came to Coach Odell like, look, whatever it is, we're going to get it done this week. That was the, that was the mood the whole game. What is, what is it about Coach Odell that makes players rise their level for, uh, around and rally around him? Um, There's not no shot at anybody else, but just with Coach Odell, it's just like you just know that uh, he like – he like one of us, you know what I'm saying? Like he's a Florida State guy, and he just bleed. He bleed garnered and gold. And not no shot at anybody. Just that's just something great about Coach Odell. Like kind of like you, he needs you guys to step up in this situation. Kind of that mindset. I don't. know. It's just you know you know he love you, and it, it ain't nothing like that's all. That's all you know. You just know that he love you. He got your back, so you gotta have his back. Obviously, they had a lot of yards, but you guys bowed up a few times and forced some field goals. They missed some field goals. Um, what was the mindset, even though they were, they were moving the ball uh, defensively? Ben, don't break. Ben, don't break. You play is going to happen. Other team going to make some plays, but you just can't you can't fold once you get in that red zone. Just stay locked in, make plays. With, all, with everything that's going on this week, and so, so obviously the team was emotional after the win today, I guess was this win kind of validating for you guys as a team to come out on top? It definitely was. I mean, look, we, we, we came to the game looking to win. That's something we needed to happen <coughs> and came out, got it. So it's just a great feeling after the game. It's been like 50 years since a Florida State player had that many tackles in a game. Um, did you feel it out there like you were racking them up like that, or could you even tell? Um, I felt I had some tackles, but not knowing as much as I thought I had. The, uh, the throwback play they called at the end of the second quarter, it looked like it was pretty set up, and I think it was Stanford made the tackle on the guys. How important was that play and keeping them off the board at the end of the quarter? I mean, as I, honestly, I was running over there, and first thing I thought was don't let them score. And I don't know where Stan came from, but he made it before the fourth down or before the, uh, the first down. So I was so happy about that play because I was just I was focused on not letting them score. We got off the field on the play, so that was a big play, huge play. With what Jordan Travis did today, is that something you guys see a lot in, in practice? Um, definitely. I mean, you can't really tackle quarterbacks in practice anyway, so it's it's more like, wow, maybe we would have missed some of them tackles in practice that, <laughs> that we tell him, we tell him, we tapped him and we got him, but maybe, we, shoot, <laughs> you see what he did? <laughs> two touches, two touchdowns. Pretty cool for him. Obviously, he's been through a lot to get to this point and then to be ready in that moment and come through. Is it as a teammate, that feel good for you guys to see him do that? Absolutely. Like, he come out work every, every day, just how we work every day. And it's just great to see anybody on the team make a play. I mean, Trav, DJ with that big catch at the end, Terry always making plays. Just anybody that make a play is just when you see somebody work, then you get to see them make a play, you can just be that much more happy for them because you know that they work for it. A lot of the young guys on this team signed with, for Coach Tag. Were you concerned about them at all? Did you talk to the younger guys? Because uh, they haven't been through, you got you've been through this before. But they haven't been through something like this before. Uh, it's definitely a time where you know you got you got to step up and be a leader. But more of the focus was on look, we got a game this week. We got to get the same same way we prepare for any game. We got to get on the film. We got to get these these practices in. Have good practices, and that was really the focus on the week. Just make sure we have real good days of practice. Come out here and perform. You knew going into the game that the Boston College offense was going to be physical. Did you guys you feel like you matched that physicality? Um, I feel like we did a good job matching physicality. We knew coming into the game they were going to try to run the ball, and that's what they came out trying to do that and stop them for the most part. You feel good knowing you'll have a chance at home to get a sixth win and get back in the postseason? Absolutely. That's, that's another reason this, this win felt so good.